Access prohibited. This area is off limits. We strongly advise that you go through the training course before embarking on your first mission. There are many nuances and features you may overlook otherwise. If you prefer to skip training, just head to the exit. each lesson in order to proceed. Now step up to the active station designated by the flashing light. Your crosshair will change to indicate an item that can be activated. All right, now open the door to the next area. Bystanders will often speak to you if you activate them. Sometimes they will share useful inf- Well done! Alright, now open the door to the next area. If you want to skip a cutscene, simply- Congratulations! You've completed the basic field tactics course. You should now continue to the advanced field tactics area, where you will receive specific instruction for your upcoming mission. Note that new simulations will be prepared for you before each mission. Well 
done. The volume of your footsteps can be modified by the material upon which you're moving. Be careful of tile, metal, and other hard surfaces. Whenever possible, favor carpet or turf. All right, now open the door to the next area. Try again. Step behind the yellow line to reset the simulation. Wow, you're pretty light-footed. If you're not sure what to expect around a corner, it is generally safe to step out for a moment to see what's up ahead. As long as you duck back quickly, you probably won't be spotted. Of course, the closer you are to an enemy, the more likely it is that you'll be seen, so listen for footsteps or conversation before leaving cover. Flashlight is an effective tool, but it can also give away your position. Try not to let enemies see the beam. Want to skip training? I won't stop you, but intelligence has. So, are you enjoying yourself yet? Immensely. Sure you're not bored? I've waited nearly four years for this chance. I think I can endure another half hour. Good girl. You're growing up. What do you make of all that talk of a traitor? It wouldn't be the first time we've had leaky plumbing. Still, it's disquieting to say the least. It's happened before? Once. A few years ago, we lost several undercover operatives in Istanbul. Turned out they'd been compromised by their chief's very own administrative assistant. He'd sold us out for a measly 50 quid. 50 quid? Astonishing, isn't it? Trading men's lives for such a pittance. But spies are rarely well compensated for their treason. I wouldn't be surprised if this new mole is equally underpaid. Well, I hope when they catch the bastard, they put a bullet right between his eyes. And maybe a boot up his arse for good measure. You sound ready to volunteer. I'm dangerous when I'm upset. That's why you're always in trouble. All right. Munro's headed for the cafe. Watch for him on the second floor patio, coming from the left. What about the targets? Not sure yet. Pardon me. Uh, do you have the time? 
No, sir, I do not have a dime, and I don't have much use for beggars. Not a dime. The time. Don't get snippy with me, or I'll have you arrested. Are you deaf? How dare you threaten me? Oh, never mind. Coward! Would you like me to call out the targets for you? That would be lovely. On your left. Coming oh, out the I door on the far balcony. But we've only been here for two days. Go straight ahead, to here. the right of the tower. Why not? It's so... boring. On your left. Well, is Coming out the door country. on the far balcony. I knew that. The cannon is a foreign country, too. I thought the reason you wanted to come here was that it is so different. Yeah. Why don't you try to relax and enjoy yourself? I'll bet you have a lot of fun if you just stop worrying. You think so? Sure. Maybe you're right. Of course I'm right. Let's walk down to the Medina and see some signs. Okay. On the roof to your left. Straight ahead, to the left of the tower. Yeah. On the roof to your left. Yeah. On the roof to your right. Yeah. To your left, on the far balcony. To your left, on the far balcony. To your left, on the far balcony. On your right, street level. On your right, street level. On your left, street level. Derelict! There must be a hole in my pocket! On your left, street level. Coming out the front door of the hotel. From down the street on your left. Coming out the front door of the hotel. On your right, street level. I say, don't you people have jobs? From down the street on your left. I'll cover him for the next stretch. Get to apartment 12 and wait for my signal. Oh, and make sure to conceal your weapon or you'll cause a commotion. I heard he plans to marry the American girl. You mean the girl who refuses to wear shoes? Yes, her. I wonder if all American girls this high shoes. It seems very strange, but America is a strange country. She may be crazy, but she is attractive. Ah, but you're invariably attracted to crazy women. All women are crazy.
I'm in position. Good. He's almost there. Here he comes. Get ready. On your left. Coming around the building. Lost yourself a customer. This guy is too much. On your right, coming around the building. Not again! Where are you, you pesky little Second story man? window, on your left. Second I'm story window, find it far quickly right. Before the thieves swoop in like vultures. On your right, coming around the building. Second story window, far right. Heading toward you. Watch for him to pass in front of the right window. On your right, coming around the building. Second story window, on your left. Tell me that I was standing right here. A little humility might suit you. I'm teasing. We make a pretty good team. Damn, they must have spotted you. There's a group of thugs heading your way. How many? Looks like six of them. Can you handle it? Of course I can. I'll meet you at the hotel in an hour. All right. Take care of yourself. First, I'm going to take care of some evildoers. Keep your men out of sight. We don't want to spoil our trap, do we? Yes, sir. I mean, no, sir. I mean, yes to the first part and no to the second part, sir. Shut up. Just do as I say, you idiot. You look like you need a monkey. Excuse me. I have a very fine monkey for you. Only $20 American. Sorry, I don't want a monkey. What do you mean? I don't want a monkey. Why not? Because I don't like monkeys. Now get that filthy beast away from me. Are you insulting my monkey? I'm sure it's a perfectly excellent monkey, but I... Uh, get down, everybody! Not my favorite! <laughs> Who is there? Who's there? Oh. Who's there? Maybe 
I'm hearing things. What is this? Who's there? Mr. Volkov said the girl will be here soon. How will we recognize her? You didn't see the for hey, you know, everybody! <laughs> What sort of getaway did you have in mind? Something quiet and romantic. It's for our anniversary. Well, in that case, perhaps... Any sign of her yet? No. You do not move! She's over here! Are you all right? <laughs> I <d> <laughs> Late, as usual. I was beginning to worry. You always worry. Can you blame me? You're like an errant child. And you're like a fussy aunt. You could at least leave my gender intact. A fussy uncle, then. Thank you. I'm having fun. 
I can see that. But don't get reckless. We're not out of danger yet. I know. This place is crawling with thugs. Damn! How did they find us? We've been betrayed. It's the only explanation. Are you sure you weren't followed? Yes, positive. If they know about the hotel, they'll probably be waiting for us at the coast. We'll have to risk it. If we aren't aboard the Abigail when she sails, we'll have to get out of Morocco on our own. Or you could stay here. Permanently. Volkov! Get down! Let's go! I have dreamed about this day for six years. Bruno! I only regret I do not have time to make your demise more eventful. After him. This is all my fault. If you hadn't been worrying about me, he never would have got the drop on you. <sighs> Silly girl. Worrying about you is all I have left. Don't say that. I've always had plenty to die for. You've given me something to live for. Then live. In your memory, perhaps. Bruno! The girl's in the lobby. Kill her! But why didn't you kill her, Mr. Volkov? I meant to, but my hunger for revenge distracted me. Let that be a lesson not to be ruled by your emotions. Excellent advice, sir. Well, I'll go shoot her now. Make sure there are no witnesses. You mean we should kill everybody? First, kill everybody. Then, destroy the hotel. Let our enemies search the rubble for answers. They shall find none. Someone there? Help me!
You can't hide from me, Volkov. I'll find you wherever you go. Kill her, you incompetent fools! I wouldn't give you a rotten fig for that disgusting animal. Look out for the bullets! Stay where you are! I suggest giving you... <laughs> Thank you. 
Get everybody down low! Huh? Who are you? Good afternoon. You're wasting your time. I won't talk. I have been trained to resist all forms of torture. We'll see about that. Do your worst. Did you enjoy that? Not really. <laughs> Ruthless woman. Have you had enough? Yes, thank you. But I still won't talk. <laughs> you don't even know where he is, do you? Yes, I do! What was I thinking? Why would Dmitri Volkov tell a lackey like you where he was going? Dmitri and I are very close. Very close. Mm-hmm. And I don't appreciate being called a lackey. I work very hard. It's not easy being a criminal, you know. There's a great deal of pressure. Goodbye. Wait, wait! Don't go! I don't know where Volkov is, but I do have something you may be interested in. It should only take about 15 minutes to get to the airport. You'd like that, wouldn't you? Excuse me? Not on your life, you scoundrel! I'm an American citizen! We have morals in America! I don't understand what you're talking about. This is unbearable! Pull over this instant! I'd rather walk to the airport than listen to this filth! I thought this was supposed to be a civilized country! No sign of her. Are you sure she's coming? She'll be here. 
If she gets away, I will kill any man she leaves alive. Am I understood? Explicitly. Hmm.
Are you okay? Do not move. Who is it?
Is someone there? Who is there? Is someone there? Oh, nothing. There's a ship out there. Should we tell you? Give it. Go ahead! Go! What are you doing here? <coughs> Who's there?
You're going to meet your maker! Someone there? No, please! Ah! We will meet again, Miss Archer. Needless to say, the Morocco assignment was an unmitigated disaster. Report... Well, I think we can classify Morocco as a complete disaster. I knew we were asking for trouble sending a woman and a fossil like Lowry on an assignment like this. Let's not rush to judgment, shall we? Rush to judgment? I think the facts speak plainly enough. Ambassador Monroe is dead. Welcome to Advanced Field Tactics. What appears to be a stylish pair of women's sunglasses is actually a multiple exposure spy camera with an adjustable zoom. Simply put them on, orient the viewfinder, and snap a shot. Remember that you can zoom in for a closer look at a distant target. Take a picture of this intelligence item with your sunglasses. All right, now open the door to the next area. Unfortunately, this cigarette lighter is just an ordinary run-of-the-mill cigarette lighter. Still, it can be useful for providing light, starting fires, or lighting cigarettes. You All right, now open the door to the next area. These relatively inconspicuous-looking lipsticks are actually powerful explosive devices to detonate on impact. Custom yourself to the weight and explosion radius. And try not to blow yourself to smithereens. There are several important things to know about security cameras. First, 
tempting as it may be, don't destroy them if you can help it. Whoever is monitoring the security system is likely to send someone to investigate or even sound an alarm if any of the cameras goes out. Instead, try to avoid them altogether. If the light on a camera starts flashing, it means you've been detected and the camera is attempting to focus on you. Duck out of sight before you're identified as a threat. If you're close enough to the camera, you'll actually hear it focusing. Listen for it to resume scanning before stepping back into view. Finally, make sure not to leave any bodies lying in view of a camera. That's just as bad as being spotted. All right, now open the door to the next area. Lights are also best avoided. Shooting them out will likely cause every bit as much commotion as being caught in the beam. Figure out their movement patterns before attempting to bypass them. All right, now open the door to the next area. Try again. Step behind the yellow line to reset the simulation. Excellent. Excellent. We've been contacted by Dr. Otto Schenker. Guten Abend, Fräulein. Do you make love to strangers? Certainly not. Then allow me to introduce myself. Why not just introduce yourself to a police officer and spare me the trouble? Who makes up this ghast- Hello. Are you free tonight? Or will it cost me? More than you can afford. Why must I be made to say such idiotic things? Never mind that. Just tell me what you have. I was told to say, in the basement. Thank you. Tell the person who wrote the code phrase to grow up. Come in.
mean for a game of Twister? I'd rather run over you with my car. These code phrases have a somewhat confessional tone to them, don't you think? Yeah, now that you mention it. Hmm, it says, of the library. Dead end. Would you like a drink? You are the most beautiful girl I have ever seen. The entrance is hidden in the basement of the library behind the shelf. Hmm. What are you doing here? I found this money on the ground outside. I thought it might be yours. Ask a it. Go quickly. Do not get caught. Ha <laughs> Did she really say that to you? Yeah, can you believe it? So what did you do? What do you think I did? I know what I would have done. Then you have your answer. So, how was she? What do you mean? You know what I mean. No, I don't. I thought you said you... You know... What? I didn't say that. What did you say? Why do you even have to ask? I didn't think I had to ask. But I guess I was wrong. You should get your mind out of the gutter. Get some Teufel. Don't let her get away!
want to come in for a game of Twister? Guten Abend, Fahrle. Hmm, it says of the library. Go away. Nobody's home. You are the most beautiful girl. The entrance is hidden in the basement of the library behind the shelf. Hmm. What are you doing here? I found this. Haha! <laughs> Did she really say that to you? Oh, can you believe it? So what did you do? What do you think I did? I know what I would have done. Then you have your answer. So, how was she? What do you mean? You know what I mean. No, I don't. I thought you said you... You know... What? I didn't say that. What did you say? Why do you even have to... Ask. I didn't think I had to ask, but I guess I was wrong. You should get your mind out of the gutter. Get some Teufel.
Gute Nacht. Hmm, it says, of the library. The entrance is hidden in the basement of the library behind the shelf. Hmm. What are you doing? Haha! <laughs> <laughs> did she really say that to you? Yeah, can you believe it? So what did you do? What do you think I did? I know what I would have done. Then you have your answer. So, how was she? What do you mean? You know what I mean. No, I don't. I thought you said you... You know... What? I didn't say that. What did you say? Why do you even have to ask? I didn't think I had to ask. But I guess I was wrong. You get your mind out of the gutter. Get some Teufel. Cannot escape me. I'm not going anywhere! 